guys, it's Mr. Lee, Mr. Lee at fairytaletown.org. Hey, let's draw a cat. Okay, why not? Uh, so I started this drawing with a pencil. You should always start with a pencil. And I'm gonna fill it in a little bit with a, a Sharpie, maybe a couple different Sharpies, but we'll see what happens. But always start with a pencil. Now, uh, here's the cat that I drew, and then here's some cat pieces, big cat pieces right up here. Uh, and well, I'll just walk through it. Let's just do it. So here we go. So cats, cats have this muzzle thing, and that's kind of the muzzle thing is sort of like an upside down valentine. We talk about those valentine shapes a lot. I'm gonna put a little chin under here for the cat, and then maybe just a little suggestion of that lip. Here is the nose, and the nose is kind of a valentine shape too. We'll put some nostrils in there. And then uh, we're gonna bring that up just a little bit, and that's gonna be sort of the ridge of its snout of its nose. Uh, up here, here comes a big eye. So there's a big eye right there. We're gonna put the eye lid, the upper part of the eye up there. Another big eye is coming around here like that. There's that eyelid. We're gonna put some big, thick eyelashes there. And, and you know, this is not 100% a realistic cat, but it is uh, my cat. So uh, cats have those tiny little narrow eyes. We're gonna try and suggest that here. We're gonna do the twirly with that. Right over here, twirly. Always make those twirlies go in the same direction so it looks like it's going the same direction. Here's a head coming up here. We're gonna put another sort of a modified Valentine shape here, but we're gonna leave this spot kind of empty. Up here is a, up here is an ear. Comes like this, right up here. Flap right in there. Coming back down here. Inner part right there. Here's another big part of the ear up here. This is right here. That closes in. This comes back down. I think that's not too bad. And then just for the body shape, we're gonna come down here, a little shag. There's a knobby knee. <laughs> you hear something, but it's not a cat. Uh, we're just trying to make this as simple as possible, as few lines as possible, but we're going to try and find a balance between cartoony and realistic here, you guys. So here's those paws. There are three paws that are going to be visible with little kitty cat nails. Here's another paw, paw, paw right here. And little kitty cat nails there. Little belly there. There's that far leg. We're going to make, make this kitty cat sitting. So just sitting there, a little fur there, and to just kind of represent the, uh, the legs. Little nail, little belly, another foot over here. A little bit of scruff, you guys can go back and add in as much as you want. And I'm not gonna make a decision about the color of this cat. I've had three cats in my life and they were three different colors, so you guys make this cat whatever color you want. Here's a big old tail, and a little bit more, just a little, just some random scruff just to represent that fur there. And you know what, I'm gonna switch over here to get a different weight of pen so that I can make one, two, three, one, two, three, and there's your kitty cat today. And she's gonna say, me, yeah. Okay guys, we'll catch you later, bye-bye.